What is up, everyone? My name is Jacob and welcome back to my take around place, Demon Souls. Last episode, we died a lot inside of 2 1. I think we even attempted to do uh, a little bit of the storm thing, but uh, since we made it to the boss, we'll just stay and try to complete the boss. As well as my TV's up, so I can turn that down. Anywho, it's been quite some time. I gotta get my mic situated, so hopefully that is fine. Uh, it's been some time since I've recorded, actually some time being a week. Uh, normally on the weekends I do record, and this weekend I didn't, uh, this weekend being yesterday, uh, the last few days, because I was out of town. I went to a concert, it was a, uh, it was a concert, it was a K-pop show, and it was fun. It was really, really enjoyable. I enjoyed every second of it. Okay, I gotta remember... Oh wait, never mind. I was like, I have to remember th that I have to kill these enemies. I'm like, wait, nope, never mind. I just have to come over here. Thing is, you can actually cross this while lava's up. I didn't know that. I was watching a speed run, and not really a speed run, but more of a uh, challenge run where the person was trying to beat all the Demon Souls, well, Souls games or From Soft Souls games with the Moonlight Sword. It was. Oh, oh, I die. Oh, because those are explosives. That's right. Might be. But yeah, uh, I went to the concert. It was fun. Uh, to <laughs> my friends who were kind of there. Oh. Hey, at least we killed them. I should be using magic when I uh, fight those things. Yeah, I know I lost my 400 souls, but I, I don't care. It's 400 souls. We can get those back. No problem. I don't know why I picked that up. It's only zero. What? Ten, apparently. I think because I killed him before he died, so. Okay. But, continue my rant and story and whatnot. So, yeah, oh my goodness. Can I like, not die every three seconds? But anyway. So, I went to this show. It was very fun. Uh, this was technically the first K-pop show I went to. And to my friends, they uh, probably thought it wasn't having that much fun because I wasn't, like, super expressive they as they were. Which is not the case. Can we... Uh, thing is, I, I don't really express how, like, excited I am for things just because I... I guess in my way, I think I'm embarrassed too, or, or, I don't know, it's just, it's something I, I feel like I get judged for it, even though I shouldn't care what other people think, and everyone there is excited for the same thing, so, so, I don't know why I, alright, let's, this guy shoot, whoop everything. One more. Now we just wait. So that's why I was gone. That's why there was no co-op recorded this weekend. Because I was gone. As for next weekend, I don't know. Uh, Changes all is probably still going to be the same, but we never know. Uh, everyone could be busy this week. Uh, I was busy last week, so. That's magic. Oh, I should be fine behind the pillar. Yeah. Oh, big damage there. I really don't want to use my uh, healing items. Because we have to fight a boss and we have no healing items. All right, oh, there we go. So these guys luckily drop full moon grass. That actually doesn't really help us with anything. Right, there is an enemy up here. He always falls down. Uh, he also drops that, and there we go. Oh man, that pretty much just one shot to those guys. Uh, so, 
Yeah, I don't have any more stories. To... Actually, no. Uh, every other week, we do D&D. &D. But I woke up this morning at like 2 o'clock. Actually, 3 o'clock, I woke up at my phone. It's like, you have notifications. I was like, as this, like, I continue to, like, the group chat. Everyone saying it was nice meeting everyone. Thanks for this awesome event, which which is more proud. It was fun meeting uh, these people. They're cool. I don't think we had to worry about anything. Uh, let's equip our stuff real quick. Do we have anything else we can pit on? We could pit on sticky right stuff. And it makes our melee weapons do a little bit more damage, but I don't think I want to try that. And I, our boss, Armor Spider. We don't want to get hit by webs because it makes. Dodge, uh, we can't dodge. Let's heal real quick. I think it might be better if we just... Okay. Honestly, with magic and we're close up, Kinda easy to deal with them. Okay, he's doing that. Alright, this attack he spreads the uh ground with like things and sketches on fire. Just get far back. You know, just heal up and just wait for it. I forget about the uh, thing we can't roll. I think we'll die if we hit by one more fire attack. Okay. Not three ones though. I'll just heal real quick. And we got hit by another web. Let's get into the arena and then dodge these attacks. It's super more easier to dodge. Because you're just staying in the middle. Oh, okay, with magic, the demon spot is really easy to fight. Like, no problem at all. Even with uh, melee, he's not that bad. Because the only two attacks you have to worry about when you get close to him is the slam and then swipe, which... Just roll. You just dash through them. It's not super that hard. Uh, so keep that in mind. All right, spider chunk, spider stone chunk. I mean. Uh, and we will get the hard demon soul in the pure thing. And also, this allows us to teleport out. I don't want the was it to run away? So I'm gonna kill these things real quick. There you go. This allows us to get. Oh, it's because we need those. Oh, I also, those things are bombs. Now we can easily just go fight the next boss because there's two routes you can take. Uh, there's one we could go do, uh, but I don't think I want to do that stuff yet. We're going to do all 2-2 stuff later, uh, but it does open up some new stuff for us. Uh, we're going to go back to the Nexus, and probably level up real quick. Yeah, what does the Hard Demon Soul give us? Alright, so we actually want to keep this one, because it gives us a spell 
and also, well, a spell from either or. There's two different magic uses that we can do, so we're going to store both of these. Organi organize, put this in. I think the one that we did have, I think the first boss, uh, the lead demon, that doesn't give us anything other than a spear, so we don't have to worry about that. Uh, put that away. Uh, and that's about it. I'll put our stones away. And when you upgrade, it consumes the storage box as well. That's not what I wanted to do. Uh, we'll keep both these just in case. Uh, since we're not in human form, or well, in human form, let's have the thief ring equipped in. Not being detected by enemies is going to be really useful for our next. Uh, I want to seek power. Uh, psh, let's get magic up, I guess. Intelligence would just give us mana, which would be useful. Oh, let's just get one level. And the rest of the souls, we will. Yes. Uh, we're gonna go back here and go to a shop real quick and then do that. Anyway, as I was saying about D and D, uh, I've got a mess. There was a message in the D and D Discord saying that one person said that they're gonna be leaving the uh, what you call it, the group. Anyway, I don't know why I stopped talking when I was hitting that thing. For some reason, I'm like, oh. <gasps> okay. We're good. But anyway, uh, yeah, they said they was going to quit the uh, D &D, uh, group. And then afterwards, our DM basically said, I'm done. I don't like doing it anymore. And for, I want to buy 10. Uh, actually, I didn't even break a lot. You know what? 10 more. Here's the thing, uh, in this game, it also here's the thing, Drop Shadone and stuff, it costs, uh, you can buy them here, and two, two, there's an NPC that sells these as well, whoops, and also the second tier one, I didn't know this guy sold these, and I only needed these, so I would run to that guy, buy that, and, and I'll, let's play, uh, Alex is like, hey, this guy sells that, you don't have to go that far, and I'm like, god dang it, I guess the rest of it, I'll just hold on to it. Uh, also, I never, I don't think I did this, but there is another area we can go. I want to go do it real quick. Yeah, so our D&D group has been disbanded. I don't know if it's just like a temporary thing where like maybe uh, it's just he's just not in the mood to do it. Like, do, wait, can we not? Is there a different way to get this going? Because you can... Go down there and grab stuff. But I don't know how we turn that on. Oh, right here. I, for some reason, thought you gotta activate the other one and that would turn this one on. Uh, what's at the very top? I think this is how you can get up here to fight the enemies. Oh, so we could have actually done this from the get go. We're gonna put our blade on because this increases our magic power. Wait till he attacks, then we cast. Roll, cast. I will say playing magic is actually kind of fun. I mean, you know, some people would be like, well, this, you know, that means you're not, you know, good, you, you know, blah, 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 and all that jazz. I've beat this game twice with melee stuff. So, like, yeah, one playthrough I had my friend do most of the walking around, and I just attempted the boss. Okay, understandable. But, like, my second playthrough I played through just fine. This game isn't really hard. Some of the bosses are quite annoying, yes. But that's, that's just how souls are. Uh, upgrade to, oh, upgrade, update to, uh, my Elden Ring, uh, playthrough. 
Uh, I was streaming it, but I think I want to stop streaming it because I would rather enjoy the game myself and not because I only stream two night, uh, days of the week. So I think I'm not going to stream it. Instead, just kind of if I streamed more often, like every single day, then maybe. But I don't because I just don't personally like doing. It. I I like streaming. Don't get me wrong; it's fun to do. But it's just not for me. I, I feel like I would rather have fun just sitting and enjoying games myself. That's all that's down here. I don't know if I ever explained what those uh, stone things are. That just gives us back in our body form, which is good and bad. It's good because we have more health. It's bad because, well, you can die easily. Also, uh, in this game, there's a cap of 25 HP. I mean, uh, not 25 HP, 25 uh, grass. I didn't know that because I spent more and it's like, you can buy as much as you want, but you can only have 25 on you. The rest of it's sent to your storage. I was so confused because in the PS3 version, you can get up to like 90. That's what we did. We got to a level that we're like, we're decent. We one shot, well, not one shot. We do a lot of damage. We don't really need to up level up anymore. Anyway, we want to go to two da oh, three dash one. This map, this one, oh, this level is actually really cool, but it is so frustrating. <laughs> uh, there's a lot to this. The Prison of Hope. So, where we want to go is actually this way, but we can't because we need the key. And there's also a lot of stuff. These guide, uh, guiding things would be really useful. It allows us to... Uh, do that actually. Oh, this is where we spawned. Okay. So you can check every single one of these doors and see that there's prisoners inside and you can open it up. And some of them may have items, but most of the time they don't. Like this one has an item, but we can't get into it. But we want to look out for those enemies. Because these guys can do a ton of damage. How much? Okay, that attack will stun us. And if we get stunned, he will come up to us and basically command grab. I'm using fighting game terms, but anyway, we got fresh spice, which we're gonna need those actually, because we actually need those. But uh, yeah, I'm using fighting game terms, but a command grab, if you guys don't know, is a grab. <laughs> Uh, or technically, yeah, it's just a grab. A command grab is, I think, it's just uh, import grab motion, not just like forward heavy or like me, like medium, uh, light kick. And I think it's medium kick and medium punch is usually grab. And like for like, uh, what you want. There's actually a glitch you can do it here, which I've learned from watching speedruns. Uh, if you save and quit the game and then respawn, you can slowly walk to these things. Oh no, I think you, I don't know what you do, but it's something like that. But now we can open up all these doors because we have this floor's uh, prison key. Uh, I, by the way, I know I have a map open. This map, the place still confuses me to this day. Granted, I can just keep walking around until I get stuff, but I actually want to go. Now, earlier you might have saw the subtitle say, uh, pop up saying, please help me. Oh. Uh, yeah, that. That's super annoying. Uh, we can't do anything about it. Oh, we got wizard stuff. Oh, does that do anything to our magic? We have wizard clothing. Oh, we already have wizard clothing. Just not the hat. Okay, never mind. Okay. Uh, I don't think there's anything else on this floor that we can grab at the moment. When I first played through this, I didn't know where I was going, and I kept falling off and dying. And then you start back at the beginning, and you're like, okay, am I going the right way? Gotta be careful, because I don't know what's at the end. I think there's another one of those. Yeah, there he is. Okay, I think Sully's going to follow us now. Yeah, there he is. Okay, he turned around. Trust me, those enemies are 
terrifying, and we don't have really the strength to deal damage. So we have to kind of cast magic. I'm gonna wait for him to cast something. They have, they have two attacks. They have a magic spell they can just shoot off, and they also have uh, that green laser, and that's when they will walk up and grab you. It does a ton of... I thought that was just a breakable object, so I was just, I'm just gonna break it. I just got a uh, super attack. I, I don't know when Bloodborne they're called Viscerals, but in this game they're called something else. But uh, we can also open up these doors because we're well, still on the same floor. Uh, I'm going to say this now. Don't open every single door unless there's an item inside of it. Reason for it is if they have prisoners and they like they will come after you and be like, oh, thank you to free us. Or free us or something like that. They just stand next to you. Like this. I don't think he's going to attack. But yeah, they're going to just follow you and just do that. They won't attack you. So you can just attack them and get rid of them. But the problem is the door is always going to be free now. So how do I get these down? Oh, that's one way. Because I was so confused by that. I don't see those in different places, but like, how do I even get that? There's an item in here. Now, some of these guys will attack you, so just get rid of all of them. Now, there's that if you didn't have that already. So, if you would have chose the wizard path, you would have to wait to get to this level to get that which is useful for uh i'm gonna dodge back over a spell oh i missed i hit him from here no, i cannot walk back over and if he's not dead okay yeah okay that's fine so that's it Okay, uh, game just t totally decided to. But that was just three attacks. He's like a magic bolt. He has the green thing. And he will walk up. If he does the green attack and then starts casting it like another spell, you're fine because like most done, those won't kill you. What's in here? Also, you can kill these guys before you open the door. I can't hit that. I I don't think there's anything else over here. Oh, th yeah, this is nothing in there. Why am I even doing that? I got uh, free souls, I guess. Whatever. Ooh. And this will give us the Prison of Hope third floor key. Uh, this will allow us to open up the actual thing. The one we got is cell doors. So I don't think there's anything else in here. Okay, this guy had a spear. Okay, I gotta be careful because... With spears, they can actually hurt, hurt me. You know what? Open the door. I like that. Loser. Uh, something in there. So grab that. This is... Mercury stone. I don't know what mercury stone is used for. Maybe that's for the magic weapons you need to use to upgrade. I'm not entirely sure. All right, this is a uh, thing we can't go. So we're kind of at a dead end. And up oh, at the end of this floor. So we have to go back. So now they're at the third floor key. We can actually head back to uh, where we spawned and do that. Why well, after 25 minutes? I was kind of hoping to speed run through this, but then I remembered. Oh, wait, this is the uh, prison. This is going to take a while. <laughs> we might not be able to get to the boss. It might be the same thing with like a 2-1 where we will get to the boss, but then call it quits with the episode and then start the next video, fight the boss, then go through that. All right, since now we have that, I want to keep healing real quick because I'm... I want to be at half. So that's pretty much full. Alright, this will allow us to open up the door to where we need to go. 
And look, fog, there's a boss. Oh, no, there's no boss. Anyway, continuing back to my Elden Ring talk from like hours ago. Uh, I stopped, decided to stop streaming it. Uh, I was actually getting frustrated, not at the game, but just in general, I was getting frustrated at like other things. The, the, uh, like me dying to the boss doesn't bother me. I get it, you know, it's a Souls game. I'm going to either die or and get good or just keep dying. I don't know, I, sometimes if you open up this, you will, uh, there'll be an enemy in there and they always They always will be able to hit you. So anyway, I fought the boss a little bit more. Uh, Margaret? Is it Margaret? Or I don't remember. What, but uh, I fought him a couple of times. And then eventually I learned like, all his patterns. I'll still get hit by stuff every time. I but eventually I beat him. I was so excited and happy. I'm like, finally! And I... A lot of en uh, enemies in there. Oh yeah, we can't even open up anything yet. My bad, guys. Oh wait. Oh wait, no, that, we didn't get anything. That just told us. Hey, I think you want to be careful over here, because I think there is a pit over here. No, it's not. I was, I was wrong. All right, let's just go in here. Yeah, I killed the first boss, like the first major boss you can fight. I found another dungeon, fought another boss that was actually kind of easy to fight. And I, I think you guys always have souls. I think this one is going to have oh, more souls. Oh no, uh, black set. The assassin mask is cool, but I think there's enemies in here. Oh yeah, this is where we get an enemy and then we get poisoned. So we have to equip a poison item. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're good. I was not expecting him to be there. I was like, okay, we get that. I close the inventory and I see him. <laughs> I panicked. Alright, I'll just kill this guy. Some more fresh spice, which is good. I forgot that guy roams this area. And there we go. There's also uh, the cell key and the uh, fourth floor key, which allows us to open up doors in this floor. Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's where the pit is. So. This takes us back to the front. This is where I get confused last time because I'm like, where am I? And you're on the other side of the, the third floor. And I was so confused. And I rolled up. Also, there was a point I didn't see where I was supposed to go. And I didn't see the edge. And I walked off the edge. And I had like 2,000 souls at that time. And I lost them. And then, yeah. You know, I kind of got to the point. The same thing with like the souls. Uh, the same thing with like Pikmin's. To me, if I see I have like like three thousand souls and I lose it, I'm like, oh well, who cares? I can get it back. With Pikmin, it's the same way. I, I would just throw Pikmin's before I was like, I can't lose them; they're precious to me. Now I'm like, I've done three different games without losing a single Pikmin. It's not, uh, it's fine. I know I brag about that a lot. Like, oh yeah, I've done a. Can you guys like? Who else? 
I think once you attack them, they attack you back. But I could be completely wrong. You got a dagger. No, they don't. Okay, you guys can stay alive. Just kidding. You guys are like. I guess only worth three. Never mind. You guys are worthless. I could have kept you guys up. No, you guys can stay alive. Uh, I think that's the only thing on this floor. That we could no. This yeah, this is the second floor. So we got the consumable item. We got the claw. No, we got everything. So there's not nothing else. I think on this floor. Actually, at the beginning of it. There's a room. Oh yeah, we got the stuff. This door. Isn't that door already open? Now, now that we have the key, we can actually go in here. Just kidding, I was lying. Just don't listen to what I said. Hey, guy. Oh, we're gonna switch into us other weapon this is good for dealing with a um, mob of enemies and also just enemies just standing there let's even one shot them granted we only have one strength I do not know why I'm making it getting up more difficult than it should be uh is that it? Yeah, that's all that's in there. Uh, was it down this way? E oh, okay. Yeah, this is where we want to go. So you don't want to go all the way over to the other side because you'll fall off. Okay, so. I was right and wrong. I said, you go into here. No. You go in over here. Well, he obviously sees me. <laughs> but just can't do anything about it. I could have sworn it was a door we went. No, it, yeah, this is right. I just remembered. All right, we're going to open this and then quickly roll out of the way. That still hit me. Okay, get behind the wall so we can at least see the Oh, he took two, he got stuck on a uh, pot, so he couldn't actually go past. We got super lucky there. I was like, oh, we're past it. But yeah, you come through here. There's something right there. I think that's all there is. Just a fresh spice. Okay. Yeah, it's just, the, I think I thought the door is where you went through because I remember seeing the door. Ow! Oh god, you hit me hard, but you're dead. These guys also give a lot of souls. Oh, I didn't drop anything. Sad. I believe one of these doors do open if you have, like, pure white or something. But unfortunately, we don't. Um, Eastern Pike Castle. Where do you come from? Uh, my house. Your reach too far. Oh, perhaps you'd like something from the workshop. 
As you know better, Dora. I was once the wife of a nobility, and I have been your sinister shepherd. Well, I'll take the full moon grass. I'll take three of them. Other than that, I don't think I really need anything. Maybe bright water be useful. Uh, you have a rapier. Moonlight shards. Uh, you do have a... A cool ring that I could grind up 50,000 souls to grab. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. I don't know where she spawns in the second world. Usually, if you find an NPC that has a shop, and then you go to the next world, they're in a different location. And you can't see that. Unlike world one, I think, world two, that one guy. Uh, we fell once again. Guess I'll see you guys in the top again in a second. Actually, where, where are we? This is not right here that we never got. There's also something glowing over there. Oh, okay. Yeah, this is where that uh, thing is. We have to come back over there. Never mind. All right. Uh, see you guys in a second. Oh, right, we're back. Uh, I was walking back. I saw my phone go off. So I was like, okay, I guess I'll answer it since I'm in that transition stage anyway. And it was a spam call. I don't think it was a spam call, but it was like, oh, spam risk. So I was like, I'll answer it anyway because I need to answer them. This is where the hole is. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Also, an item here. I guess we already picked it up. Yeah, I think I picked it up and then fell off. But uh, I was like, yeah, I'm doing a survey for in the area, and I was like, bro. Based off the number, you're in a completely different state than I am. It. it there's no point for me to do a survey for something that I don't know what you're talking about. So I was just like, he's like, can I ask you a few questions? And just hung up. I was like, yeah, no, I do not care. Uh, I think there's items in here, but there's also enemies that can poison us. So be quite careful of that. I think this one has it. No, this is a uh, soul item. This has enemy. I hate the fact that they can poison you straight away. And then you have to use a poison item. And if you don't have a poison item, you just kind of have to wait for it to, di to die. I don't want to use a full moon grass. I want to use my crescent ones. We'll probably buy more soul. I mean, grass later. Especially since we just got... Magic... Wait, I'm bringing a magical sharpness. What's that? Magic power, uh, raises magic power, but lowers magical defense. Would be good, uh, but we don't want to do that for two reasons. Reason number one, uh, the boss of this area uses magic, and if we make it so we do more damage, but take more damage, that eh, might not be fun. Uh, but we can open up this. This will take us to a thing that allows us to go down. And I want to heal up because I, I feel correct. There's actually one of those one enemy is around here. No, okay. We can go to the other side. This is where that other thing was that we couldn't get to. Get down this guy and we can grab whatever this item is. Just noble lo lotus. Awesome.
There's nothing in there. It appears to be locked. But yeah, that is uh, one of the people that we can talk to. To that's who we need to free. But of course, we don't have the key because we need a special key to do that. And that special key is gotten from a boss. All right, so we can go to the second portion of this. I mean, once you get to this area, it's pretty much just easy pickings. Uh, I know there's a guy here. So we can't go through this because we need a key since we don't have the key, we can't do it. Same thing for this, they're both the same area, just... Yeah, I could have sworn there's one of those guys in here. I guess not. Or is it down here? Alright, be careful, I think in here is where it... Yeah, he's right over there. I'm gonna lock it onto him. So we can get two hits in before he reacts. See what he does. Shoots magic. Can I lock onto him, please? There you go. So, since we're on another floor, I don't think we can open up any of this. Yeah. Because this is, I think, floor two. And we don't have the key to the second floor. Which sucks. Hey. I want to open it. Can I just talk to him? You are a sane one, have you not? My name is Schneider. Please, liberate me from this jail. Oh, uh, I don't know if the door is open here, but I think if you get black uh, Tendency for this uh, His black phantom will spawn you have to defeat him. I don't think that unlocks anything with him, but it is there All right, so we can't go that way Bro. And if you have right him to see, I believe this door opens. Or something opens. I don't know. I didn't see a key thing here. So how does one get through this? seen a key thing anywhere there another location we can go yes down no we can't go down either Oh. There we go, we got the first floor. Where we, when do we get to the first floor? Wait, where are we? Oh, wait, I know where we are. Alright, yeah, so this is where we used all that stuff. We were on second floor. 
we were on the second floor, but we still don't have... Wait, no, we do. When did we get cells for, uh... Oh, we have the key now. Can we open this? No, we need a special key to open that. Okay, whatever. But I believe there's an item in this room we can get. Oh, we can't even open that. Wow. Wait. We can't open up these. Or we can only open up that one? How was he able to... Is he able to open up that door, or we can't open up any of the other ones? Okay. Mm, don't know. Don't care, but since we have the first floor key, we can actually just open up this. Now, where is... There we go. Now, we're on the first floor. And before we explore more of the third floor, I might just call it quits here and record another episode straight afterwards uh, and do more in this thing. Because this, this one is actually a big one. Most of the maps are kind of linear to get it done. This one kind of huge. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And in the next episode of Demon Souls, we will continue onwards. Hope you enjoyed. See you guys later.